Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tammy, and I'm gonna kind of go through with you what our kids' chores are and kind of how they help around through the around the house. I'm hoping that this kind of gives you guys ideas on how to get your children involved with cleaning and helping around the house too. This is Kendall. She is our nine-year-old. Um, as you can see, she is helping putting presents under the tree. Now, these are sibling gift presents, so no presents from Santa or Mommy and Daddy, but she is helping put them around the tree, and then I do have her go around the house with just a Swiffer duster. You know, once a week, I do go ahead and deep clean everything, but since we have dark furniture it does show dust very easily so this is super easy for her and I think definitely age appropriate she can move some bigger you know heavier items out of the way not heavier but like glass items um, better than the younger ones can I do want to say that these are not all of their chores. Um, we also are not super demanding on them, but we do have them help us. They, they live here too, so we just kind of feel like that as a family living under our roof that everyone can put in and help take care of where they live. So this is Hayden. She's our 11 year old. She'll actually be 12 here soon. She does the dishes. Her chore is specifically the dishes. She loads and unloads the dishwasher and if there's anything extra that won't fit in the dishwasher or something that has to be hand washed like my tumblers um, and some other things, she will go ahead and hand wash everything and then sit them on the counter to dry. I don't make her dry them. Um, they sit on the counter overnight and then in the morning she puts everything away when she puts away the other clean dishes out of the dishwasher. When she's all done, she goes ahead and scrubs out the sink, and then she also, besides doing the dishes, she also takes care of the cat water. Um, every day, she scrubs out the cat bowl, or cat water, er, I guess, <laughs> um, and then she will fill it up for the day. We do have two of them, two uh, water dispensers, I guess, if you will, so that is her chores. Um, in addition to the everyday chores that our children have. They are also required to make their beds during the week. We don't, we get lazy on the weekends, guys. We, we're not perfect, but um, during the week, they are required to make their beds and then they also uh, put away and fold their own laundry. Alright guys, this is Freddy. He is our youngest, our six-year-old. He has less chores than the girls because he is, you know, still kind of little and he can only do so much, but he does help. Um, he is making his bed, which again, we do ask our children to make their bed. Do they get made every day? No. Um, weekends, we're pretty much pretty lazy and lax on, on the chores uh, with bed making. However, during the week we try our hardest to get the beds made every day. So, anyway, this is how he makes his bed. You know, whatever works. It's actually pretty cute in my opinion.
addition to making his bed, he is also required to pick up his toys um, and, you know, make sure that everything's kind of picked up and tidy in his room. And then he also can fold and put away his own clothes. He does need help sometimes staying focused, which you will see here. I did not cut anything out of him folding these clothes because, you guys, it was just too funny watching this. And I thought I would share with you guys. But anyway, um, he does need a little bit of help. I did get hangers down for him. Um, sometimes he can hang them. Sometimes he can't. No big deal. I will help him and then I can help put them on the bar in the closet because that he cannot reach. Um, however, he does have a stool now, so he's working on it. is so goofy you guys oh my goodness again there were a few times i did have to go in and redirect him this was one of the times oh my goodness i just had to leave this in here though because i thought it was so funny just watching him because literally i set up the camera and after i got him set up to fold his clothes i walked away and this is what he was doing Obviously, I am not one of the children, but I do, I did just want to share with you what I am doing, obviously putting the clothes away. I'm going to clean the bedroom up. Um, I'm going to use this time to tell you about our 13 year old. She does not really like to be filmed a whole lot. When I can get her to be filmed, you know, you'll see her. However, today was just one of those days and I was absolutely okay with not filming her. This is my channel and that's okay that she doesn't want to be on here. So. I'll go ahead and tell you what she does. Um, again, she is 13. She is a full-time student, obviously. She's in seventh grade. And then she also plays um, travel softball or fast pitch. So she she's very, very, very busy child. However, she still does help. She will bring down the dirty clothes. She will fold her dirty or her clean clothes and put them all away. She makes her bed just like everybody else. Um, and then she also sweeps the floors and Swiffers every single night. That is including our dining room, our kitchen. We have uh, tile in our entry in the two entryways of our home, and then also in the bathrooms. So that is her chore. That is what she does to help out around the house. And then also in the summertime, she mows the yard. Um, in addition to her inside chores, if you will. to mention that our nine-year-old also um, wipes the bathroom counters and the outside of the toilet every single day. Um, I just give her some Clorox wipes and she puts gloves on and just wipes everything out. I do not make her do the inside. That is not her job. Don't come at me for that because <laughs> I just don't think she's completely ready for that. You know, having to use bleach and everything else inside the toilet. I do that. I clean it out once a week. That's my job. So I just ask her to help 
um, wipe down the counters and stuff like that because, you know, they're kids, they get food and hair and everything else on the counters in the bathroom, so no big deal. Just wanted to mention that real quick. so much for watching if you haven't already please hit that red subscribe button it is free to subscribe no cost to you but it does help me out um, I do also want to say that what our kids do may not be appropriate for all kids of their age you know it definitely varies by child and family home and you know tons of different other things this is just what we do as a family to help out in our home and to help teach our kids about taking care of their things. Again, it may not be perfect for everybody. This is just what we do. But I really want to thank you guys for watching. And I hope this helps give you guys some motivation. And I guess we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.